Hello and welcome to our virtual tour of our 2016 Mazda CX-5 Max Sports. A little bit about us here, Pacific Toyota and Lexus of Canso, standing at one of two of our pre-owned vehicle yards, where we go through about 200 vehicles in any given month, making us one of the largest pre-owned vehicle departments in Queensland. Across the road though, you've got parts and services attached out the back of the brand new part of Toyota and Lexus. And as you can see here at our main yard, just near DFO of Cairns, quite a variety of vehicles. Uh, just over the back here as well, we've actually got our showroom where we photograph each and every vehicle as they come through onto the yard. Throughout the video though, I'll be going around the CX-5 here in complete detail, just pointing out any blemishes that may appear at first point of sale. So I'll we'll start down around the front here, make sure she's nice and tidy. Uh, nice big alloy wheels, just making sure there's no scratching or gutter rash. Make sure we've got plenty of depth in those tyre tread. Yeah, that there I'd say it's probably got at least a good 85% tyre tread on that front uh, drivers. Around the front end here, just keeping an eye out for any markings or imperfections. A little bit of dirt on that one there, just keeping an eye out for stone chips. Across the bonnet, just making sure there's no dings, dents. A little bit of dirt on that one there, always good to double check. Uh, as you can see, we've got the bonnet protected there, obviously been doing its job beautifully. Down that passenger side, nice straight body. We'll cover each panel as we go. Yep. Passenger front, again, no markings, imperfections. Plenty of depth in that tyre as well. Very similar to the driver's side. And as we make our way down, on the side mirror, got a couple little stone chips just there. Now we can get these brush touched if need be. Just make sure the mirror is still in excellent condition. As we make our way down, we're getting a great reflection off that pearlescent paint, which obviously we want to keep in excellent condition as well. Beautiful, that reverse angle. Nice and straight down that passenger side. Now the passenger rear. Again, no gutter rash plenty of depth in that tyre as well. So it's great to see that consistency as we're making our way around the vehicle. Yeah, around the back end here, making sure there's no damages on the plastic. There's no massive gouges taken out of this rear bar. A couple of light markings, but nothing that's gone through the actual paint. Still very clean, very good condition. Beautiful, and as we can see, this is the all-wheel drive version as well. Yeah, While we're back here, we'll have a look in the boot, though. Yeah. A little marking on the plastic, nothing major. It is just a wear or tear item you're expected to see on a pre-owned vehicle. But as we can see, the carpet and everything's in very good condition in the back. Pull out shelf here. It's all in excellent condition as well. Good to see it's still in the vehicle. We'll have a look, make sure we've got our spare wheel and obviously our tools and everything back here as well, along with the jack and that towards the back. Beautiful. As you can see, very clean and tidy around the back end here. We'll make our way down the driver's side now. Again, giving you a good angle. Keep covering each panel as we go. But that fourth and final wheel just as clean and tidy as the rest, and just as much tire tread as well, which is great to see. Beautiful, as we make our way down. Now we've got an extra little reflective mirror there, just to help towards those blind spots. But as we can see, no dings, dents, stone chips. Nice and straight body, in excellent condition. Uh, the windscreen, no chips or cracks, again, part of that roadworthy certificate, which is including that driveway price here in Queensland. And the roof, no damages, no hail damage or anything. Again, just that great reflection on that pearlescent paint. The interior, so we'll check out the door carts, making sure there's no major wear and tear. Uh, there's no scratching or scuff marks. In very good condition. The upholstery. So back of the front two seats, no damages or scratches. The rear seats, very clean, no cuts, tears or stains. 
Beautiful. Now we do have carpet floor mats back here. And we'll have a look underneath. Not trying to hide anything. It's just been very well looked after. Uh, and even for that roof lining. Nice and clean. No damages, no sagging or anything like that. Beautiful. Leaving the plastics on top of the doors here. Still in very good condition. So it's obviously been kept out of the sun. Driver's door, most frequently used. Any wear and tear we are likely to see on this one here. Looks to be in excellent condition still. Uh, you got your electric windows for your side mirrors. Your electric folding side mirrors is that one just there as well. Very clean and tidy. Carpet floor mats up front also. Driver's seat in very good condition. We've got a little bit of wear and tear starting to come in on the side part there. It's just a couple of crease marks. Very common in vehicles nowadays. But as you can see, still in very good condition. Uh, we'll jump in and start her up for you. So you actually got two keys. Your push button starts on the left-hand side. And, uh, as we can see on the right though, you got your safety features like your eye stop uh, for your tire pressure and your traction control. Uh, the right-hand side is obviously to do with things like your cruise control. And at the end of the day, you've also got for your lights, you've got your auto lights and everything there as well. Turn that AC fan down. As we can see though, 80,071 kilometers. We'll check that authenticity shortly with the service history. Left-hand side, all your controls to do with the Bluetooth hands fee once it's all connected. And as we can see, the steering wheel is still in very good condition as well. Uh, up here, so you got your built-in sat-nav. Uh, we'll jump home. It is all touchscreen display as well. Obviously make sure that's all working. But at the end of the day, it's also where that nice large reverse camera shows up out the back, right on that rear bar, so you know exactly where the back of the car is. Make your way down, you've got all your dual climate control air conditioning and a couple of connections like USB and AUX and just below. Like most nowadays, it's in an automatic, gear knob's still in excellent condition. You got your shortcuts here for the um, head unit and obviously your electric park brake as well. But up front here, just as clean and tidy as the rest of the vehicle's been. No markings or imperfections or damages on the passenger seats. Uh, you do have the uh, dash mat that's been fitted. Just double check underneath, make sure there's no fading, cracking or stickiness. Again, not trying to hide anything, just been very well looked after. Uh, all your books are in here. Double check for the service history though, the main one people want to know about. So it's actually had its initial check done. Uh, about a thousand k's there. Uh, it's then done by Mazda again at 10,800, Mazda at 19,400, uh, Kmart Tire and Auto at 29,000. Uh, my car's then done a few at 40,000, 50,000, 60,000. Uh, again at 70,000 and we've just serviced a vehicle ourselves here at Pacific Hino which is our recon workshop at 80,000 k's so not only do you have full service history one's just been done next one's not due for another 10,000 k's last but not least though we will have a look underneath the bonnet while she's still running uh, obviously we want to make sure those services have paid off mm -hmm. Beautiful, a little bit tricky with one hand. There we go. Now underneath, just making sure there's no rust, no red dust. Very clean and tidy. So we listen to it run, there's no major knocks, rattles or squeals. Is that motor ticking over nicely. Uh, that was our virtual tour of our 2016 Mazda CX-5 Max Sports. I hope you enjoyed and look forward to hearing from you soon. Thank you.